Assalamu alaikum sir how are you oh, well, well, good, good 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 so okay you have already joined the chess.com yeah, good yeah. Yeah. So, gme sir yes inshallah inshallah yes thank you good yeah you, you can come i mean people like you become the gms no Okay. So I have loaded the recent rapid game. Very recent the rapid game you can you play. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So let's 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 analyze this one. Okay, push. The good see. Okay. Just keep giving me your feedback if there is any. Yeah? Okay. Okay. Mm, uh, you had the black pieces, yes. E4 played by opponent, you played E5. Good. Knight F3, Knight C6. Nice. G3, uh, it's not a very popular line. I mean, somehow white loses his advantage of first move. So better is, I mean, is you, you should continue with the standard development like this. I mean, you you ultimately will get some advantage because after this, I mean, this bishop will get this knight paint. You will get some 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 sort of advantage. Okay, okay, good. You played f5. Okay, with white and black, you are you are going with the same line, huh? Yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. With idea, I think want to open up the f5. Yes, yes, but uh, uh, Isa, uh, I will not recommend you. Okay, okay. for with uh, with white you can play. Okay, but with black this is a weak line. Oh, weak line. Okay. okay. I mean, opponent has played g3. That's why me you may get some some little. But I mean, if opponent plays accurately, you you will you will not get enough chances in this line. I mean. Let me let me show you. Let me let me see something. Let me see. Uh, you played here f5. Let me check in the database how often this has been played. So if in so f5 is played only five three two only 11 times 11 times okay in a nine million games data nine million game database only 11 times and the highest player who has tried with black is two three eight zero all other players are 1600, 544, 1500, something like this. So, I mean, this this is something, I mean, that you should avoid. I'm, I'm, I'm not recommending you. If you're still, I mean, there is a phase, I know. I, I have gone through this phase too, where the such sacrifice. See, once I was playing gambits too, with black and white both. Was I was once I was very fond of gamuts like this. Okay, if you know, I mean d4, d5, c4, e5, like this. I, I, I always I, I, I would try to play some gamuts and get some try to get some initiative, like you are doing this. I mean, f5 immediately trying for some initiative, but later I re realized 
playing in this way is not the way to move forward so you should you should you should get a strong base if you want to actually actually you want to move forward i mean in tournaments in every i mean if you want to excel to 2200 2300 so you then you should i mean adopt some solid variations okay. and try to focus on them because then you are wasting your time that i guarantee you this is my guarantee you will you will quit uh, both the variation viana and this one you will quit this is my guarantee okay, okay. at at some stage you will not play this i mean you you will start i mean better uh, i mean uh, try to learn from my experience okay. so and and start playing some solid lines i mean for for this event uh, you are playing on monday yeah you can continue with this because you are you are familiar with this but uh, the later on, I would suggest uh, that you should uh, choose uh, variations. And if if, if you uh, uh, ask me, to, I I can suggest you as well. But but if you 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 you, you like some sharp variations, then there are some sharp lines in in normal uh, or standard variations too. So you can adopt them. Yeah, yeah, Look uh, at some sharp uh, or or what 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 could you suggest for for black uh, if 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 uh if uh, the 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 good line uh, the, the 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 solid line for black uh here i mean i mean if the if you are uh you have decided like if 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 you decided to play uh like this i mean the, the here the nor normal course course is like bishop c5 or knight f6 you should move and if your opponent plays like Lord Royal Lopez, then it's okay. I mean, I mean here White did not play accurately as well. This is not a very famous, popular line. Okay. This is also not a popular line, and this is not good for White. The best White line is I uh, the Bishop B5 or Bishop C4. Oh, okay. So if opponent has played something like that, then you should keep moving with your normal development, like this one, and he will go something like, like this. Like you, 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 you can move something. Bishop c5. I mean, this is this is this this. this the, I mean, this type of development you can do. And after after this, uh, I mean, there there is some trick. But uh, okay, l l l let's not discuss that. Okay, this one, and maybe 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 mm, maybe here you can play d6. Yes, the normal 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 moves. And then, then go for castle or right away. Yes, I. I, I mean, this knight is uh, this pawn is hanging too, no? so white has first to save something like this, no? and then you can go something like this. I mean, now look at the position. Now you are threatening something like this. In a, if white try to avoid this, white will weaken his pawn structure. Okay. So white will weaken definitely the pawn structure. But if I'm uh, like if white goes something like this, and now you have multi options. I mean, you can castle, you can move here, uh, and uh, then move back, or you can directly move develop the, your bishop here. Mm, mm, yes, both are possible. But I mean, they like developing this. Now this this is a very very dangerous. I mean, pin. Black white has to get rid of this pin because knight is moving up, and then this will be too generous. So, so moving this, and now you come back. You see, now this pawn has weakened. Oh, okay. so after d d six, you can move something like this h six, not allowing uh, white bishop to pin this because the the development of black this black bishop is no problem for white. So knight a four maybe. I mean, threatening to this bishop, very strong bishop. But in here, you can move something like this, queen d7. Even you can allow uh, white to take this, and you then you will get a very strong center. Although you have a double pawn, but you have a very very strong center. And with the idea, you can go, you are going for a long castle. Oh. So then you will be able to try some attack from. I mean, both sides you can castle. So knight c5, d c5, something like this, and uh, and and maybe maybe the safest move here, 
is bishop e3 but this 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 is hanging so he can i think this he, he has to save this you see when you have played queen d7 this is this was hanging so queen h2 is i think the most candidate move to me so white has to save this pawn otherwise i mean so now here you can long castle and you have a you see very strong control of center and this semi open file look at the white position i mean white how can white penetrate to your territory not from the king side even not from the queen side no way but you have lot of options lots of options you have strong center you can even move something like this this and keep moving. i mean you have you have some plans and this can be met something like this queen e7 you are protecting this pawn also releasing this rook for this knight takes so and also this pawn push will be a very dangerous move so i mean a lot of options black has no and very solid game and 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 you keep continue with this i mean white has to defend something like this and now g5 is a very strong threatening to push this pawn i mean forking this pawn and the knight i mean if white takes then immediately lose the game i think takes with knight there is a check and next you are moving this pawn up or take this bishop moving this knight exchanging knight and this pawn can break all the white white structure so so many options you have i mean this is a very safe and solid way to play i mean still you are attacking still you are playing uh, some aggressive moves and if opponent did not play well i mean did not defend well still you can uh, catch him in uh, early and you your your this pawn is weak so you keep keep watching this pawn i mean do not weaken your pawn structure unless it is very necessary okay i mean this pawn move is not a good move basically but if if very like if, if white tries something like this taking this pawn threatening so it's not necessary to protect it with this i mean try as much possible i mean to protect it with the pieces i mean not to disturb your pawn structure okay, okay? because if you move this then he will get a chance to break through for a breakthrough oh, okay, okay. so avoid this because you are going to attack this way so and now you you can protect this and then this i mean this is very obvious so so many options okay let's go back uh, to i mean there are other other openings as well i mean you can decide like french like tarokan and everything i mean you can you can play anything but uh, at least uh, this type of openings you should avoid uh, these are not very good opening although playable although playable at your level it is playable but i mean it's not solid, it's not solid. My, my point of view is that if you if you want to excel in chess then ultimately you have to quit this opening and this is this is guaranteed you will quit at some stage you, you will you will realize oh what i am playing yeah this is this is not a good opening like okay. i have i'm fed up now no? i mean at, at initial level you are winning that's why you are keeping this opening but when you go up at some level you will start facing some resistance you see uh -huh. Then you will start realizing, ah, oh, what can I do? I mean, I cannot do much in this opening. Opponent takes the pawn and saves the pawn. Opponent is moving something like this. I don't have much option. I get attacked. I, I get my center pawns weak. Something like this. You will start realizing, oh, I think this is not a good idea. I must change the opening. Then you will realize. So I, I must say, if you, you are deciding after some time to quit this opening, do it now okay. i mean do it now me after this tournament start realizing that what alternate opening you are going to adopt i mean you if you want to play keep playing it with low rated players but for a for a solid uh, matches i mean higher rated players you should adopt some solid openings okay, okay. <laughs> good okay so after this d3 was played okay it's the normal course of move i mean protecting e4 
and knight f6 d6 bishop c5 all all are possible moves bishop c5 yes okay not not a bad idea okay still still i mean the strongest move white has is to take this pawn and then protect this pawn you will take a lot of time to i mean keep protecting this pawn and then black has will take a lot of time to I mean, like, like here, what your opponent did, knight c3. Okay, suppose if I take this, suppose. So what do you think? If you have a black, what do you do? Knight f6. Oh, uh, knight, f6. knight f6 and d5 both are, I mean, seems yeah, yeah, some yeah. d6 or d5. Huh? Yeah, yeah. So, I mean, threatening. Okay, suppose if d5. I'm now you are threatening to take this. Okay, taking it back and having a strong center like this. So if you play d5, okay, suppose I defend this, suppose. Yep. I'm not only defending this, but I've also created a, some threat like this check. No? Because after moving f5, this, this diagonal is very weak. Yes. So I, I have created two move simultaneously. So what do you prefer to play? One way of playing is moving knight. bishop back, getting this knight. Knight f6? Sorry? Knight f6? Knight f6, the second way. Yes, I, I yes, this is the second option. But this is also playable. Threatening this. And after this check, you can move king to f8. This is one way of playing. I mean, you, you are not going to castle, but you are moving this. And what you are doing is all you uh, you are doing is to to get back your pawn. <laughs> this is this is all. Okay, the knight f6. If you play, I mean, now this pawn is protected. There is no more check. This knight is protected too. There is no more threat to this knight. Okay, the I mean, maximum you can do something like this or be knight e7 and then try to threat this. Okay, but right now there is no threat. Mm -hmm. So white can move something bishop g2. So what do you think? Still, I mean, we are analyzing it. So, uh, so you should know that that if it is played properly, then there are some difficulties for black as well. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, what do you think? Either you are going knight d4 or knight e7. I mean, taking uh, pawn or castle. Uh, what do you think? I, th I think like, uh, knight e7. Uh, try to put more pressure on on f5. Pawn f5. Okay, knight f uh, knight e7 is possible to play. Okay, now now black is threatening to take this pawn. Okay, again, once more. So now white has to decide whether uh, either he is uh, giving back the pawn by castle. This is one of the one way of playing. I mean, this you are getting back the pawn white has already taken. The second way of playing is that I, white decided. Okay, still I am not willing to. Give up my pawn. Okay, I play g4. What is uh, your take now? How you can continue? I mean, this pawn has creating some, created some uh, problem for the development of your this white bishop and everything, your movement. So after g4, this g4 is protected with queen. And uh, how can you break? What do you think? Uh, I, I I don't know. I don't know. Yes, yes, I mean, you should, yeah. you should I mean understand if white decide to protect this pawn, then what what will you do? I mean, I'm here here are the possible continuation. Okay, I will I will guide you. Possible continuations are okay. I'm not allowing h5 is one of the oh, possible okay, continuations. Okay. Uh, uh, push. What about push uh, okay. what, uh, push push H uh, H6. I mean this this okay. one. Uh, uh, no, no, uh, H6, protect, uh, protect the, the G, G5 square. H6. So, H6. Yeah, yeah, H6. H6. So, you are not going to to attack this pawn no more? Huh? Uh, because because if you push, he will push attack, our, uh, attack, attack knight. 
yes okay. but I, I i i'm not sure if this is possible i'm not sure because this will get weakened and this knight can go up attacking this point oh uh, okay 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 yeah, 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 yeah. So I mean, here knight g4 is a good move. I mean, if if moves like this, then you can go something like this. So if castle like this, so now you can take this. Yeah, 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 yeah. So now you have taken. I'm. I mean, this knight is. So knight has to take this. I. I. I mean, knight has to take this, and now you can take it with the bishop. And now h3 is possible. S3 is possible because this knight is trapped, no? cannot come back, but still, still knight can take this f2 pawn. Yeah, so yeah. rook can takes, rook can takes, rook can takes. I mean, I mean that now black has some sort of compensation. I mean, black has compensation because has taken one pawn and next he is going to. So here, recommendation is to castle and now threatening at this point. So it is it is very difficult to protect this rook. No? Yeah. Because next moving this or this can take this uh, rook. I don't see any 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 good move from the white side. So it is not possible to push that pawn. It will be uh, uh, very dangerous for white. Oh. If white tries to push this. So best move here for white is to h3. Okay. Keep protecting this pawn. So here here best move for white is h3. And it takes takes and now you see. This is open, so white is no more able to castle king side. Same is white, so now the both will plan for go for a queen side, and this pawn, and this pawn, ultimately will, uh, I mean, uh, make black into trouble. Yeah. Because whenever white gets chance to move it, and you will get into trouble, yes. because there is no threat to this pawn, there is no threat to knight. Rook is protecting this knight. So I mean, so many, so many uh, uh, options for white. So, but white did not take it, and instead played knight c3, and you played knight f6. Both are uh, comfortable with this f5 position, and white is not taking, and you are not. I mean, here, here to me, if white, white plays knight c3, you should have done something uh something like uh, before developing this to settle this pawn but uh, or protect this pawn. at least at least d6 yes yeah. d6 is yeah. this is a better idea i mean at least now you you can protect this now if it is you can take it so let and then you are de developing this and then castle then it's okay it's a fine position for black okay yes so here you, here you should you should have done something like this. So okay. So you play knight f6, and here white replied with bishop g2, most probably. And uh, excuse me, let me get a phone call. Okay, okay.
Uh, sorry, sir. Okay. okay, I'm back. Okay. Okay. That was important for us. Okay. So after this, the uh, opponent has. Uh, you did this, sir. Okay. What opponent has played? Okay, Bishop G2. Okay, uh, Bishop G2 and you, Castle. Okay, opponent Castle, no, Bishop G5. Oh. Pinning the black knight. So now d6 is very safe move. You can play. d6 is a safe move. Yes. No, h6 is not a good idea to play. Why you are uh, offering this pawn again and again? I mean, now d6 was a better idea, I think. Still, you can play d6, and now the, your development is completed, more or less, and you still have to develop the white bishop. Because after 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 uh, after something like castle, then you can move h6, and uh, knight d5 can be. Uh, this is this is one of the threat which you were thinking, I think. Yeah. But but here you can move something like this. You can take this. It is quite possible. Uh, what, 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 bishop what, 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 uh, bishop take bishop take uh, f6 knight f6. Bishop yes, bishop, bishop six. Then rook f six. You can take. Okay. Uh, oh, okay. Knight f six. Knight f six. This is possible. I mean, ex sacrificing the exchange. Now you can take it with the queen f six, and now the e four can be met with bishop g four. This knight pin oh. is very dangerous now. Oh, okay. I mean, you have a pawn and a piece for a rook exchange. Oh. So this is playable. You have pair of bishops as well, and uh, I'm not sure queen d5 is possible here. But this is under threat. This is under threat. If queen d5 simply king h8. How how can he protect this knight? He has to go back. If moving knight, then this f2 pawn is weak. So this is not possible. So maybe maybe here 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 h h three is something that possible. H three is something that is playable. So but here takes ta taking it with the queen and queen takes and this takes and still you can move something like uh, this one because this is hanging. Oh. And I'm not sure what white will do, but I think he can do maximum this one. Oh. So you can take this bishop f2, king e2, and I mean it's 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 okay for both sides. White has an exchange for a piece and two pawns, so black has a sufficient compensation. Uh, three pounds. Sorry, now one one more taken. So, but still, still a lot. Uh, Black uh, has to struggle a lot to convert this into a win. I mean, the white has two rooks after all, and a very good white bishop. Very good white bishop. So the game will continue till end game, and let's see. So three to five. Three, three, six, and two pawn up. Sorry, not three, two pawns. Black has two pawns and a knight for a rook. So sufficient compensation. Game is more or less equal, I think. Here, I mean, it's not like that. Black or white is winning. Here. So uh, let's do. Uh, uh, what? Okay, what about capture with the with 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 the rook just now? I have, I have still yeah. have advantage on the second leg. Uh, capturing with the rook uh, in in which position in uh, the last end, uh, end? Yeah, yeah yeah in the last end game uh, capture with the just now we capture with using a bishop now uh, changing capture with the rook I mean uh, uh, not this one I think you are talking about uh, this this line h3 ah uh, yeah 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 this one so after this, this and rook, and now what? Now bishop, bishop g four. 
Bishop G4, uh, Rook H2. Yes. Okay. Rook H2. Rook takes. Okay. You 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 are thinking talking about this. Yes, this is possible too. I mean, rook takes, but uh, now oh, no. black. Oh, oh no, we um, have a, have a rook rook f rook f one. Yeah, something like this. Yes. Oh, After this okay. check, I mean, now white will white will win. I think because oh. you cannot be able to take this. So only one pawn up. Only one pawn. So rook f one is a very dangerous. Yeah, so you can check. if you take this, then this is a checkmate. Yeah, we shall check after that minute. Eh? Okay. Okay. Yes, yes, okay. yes. So this che this check is, I mean, okay, and so you can take an a, a, one more extra pawn, no? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, another, and later on, yeah. placing the bishop over here. Yeah. You should not exchange the rook at in this position. Yeah, yeah. You should not exchange. Keep both the pawns intact and keep alive all the pieces. Minor pieces can be exchanged. I mean, bishop for a knight, but should not exchange rook. Okay. Because this will help to push the pawn, king and rook. Okay. Let's go back to the original position. You f6, bishop has gone back. Nice. Nice retreat. I don't understand this retreat. So now it's very simple. I mean, you should take this. You should take this now. Oh, I think now, okay, you push this pawn now, this time. I mean, why not taking this? F4, maybe knight e4, knight e4, d e4, and now you should go for this. Because your opponent is delaying development, your opponent is delaying castle. So you should now try to play little aggressively. I mean, try to open center, try to open pieces. You have two bishops. So here, here maybe he may take this. Then you can take it with the queen. Next, you are going to pin this, and with this rook, queen, and bishop, you can take it. Oh. So here, what to do? How can white defend this pin? History. Maybe bishop e3, exchanging queens, something like this. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Bishop e3, but you can take this, queen d1, rook d1, now bishop e3 is possible. This pawn has structure has weakened. And after this, you can play this. Still, you have a threat because this rook is behind. And next, you are moving this pawn. Push, very dangerous. This is winning for black. I don't see any defense for this. Rook f1 can be met with e4. And this rook is hanging. So this is not possible. And knight, knight h4 can be met. Takes with the rook. All, all the pieces are equal. So it's not possible. Bishop e3. I don't see. So what other defense why can I do? Maybe not taking this pawn. But if you are not taking this pawn, I am going to take this pawn. And after this, maybe still I can move something like this. I mean, threatening to push, move knight, threatening to take this, threatening to queen f6, so many threats. <clears throat> Yes. So pawn for instead of pushing pawn, taking this pawn was, I mean, immediately you are creating some threat. If he takes like this, this was possible too. Rather taking it with the knight, he could have taken this pawn with the pawn. So, but bishop g4 is a killer, I think. I don't see any good defense for this. But here, here, here I can see a few other moves after this. Can this be possible? I mean, you have to move. You cannot move now d5, I think. You cannot. So d6 is the best move, threatening again the same way.
so i mean and after after pinning this night you, you have already seen there are so many problems for white i mean this rook is open this knight is moving so i'm not sure if if he can do this can you do this preventing this rook uh, bishop to g4 then now bishop developed tricks and also will embed the, with the second plan now threatening to this we have already seen this plan to you see now this point is weak no? so queen h2 again is possible to defense the at h3 defend at h3 but uh, after this i think there are too many threats too many threats one of the threat is something like you can move something this threatening this rook also you are threatening this pawn so you will capture pawn and i think black will be winning after capturing this pawn because now both the pawn will be weak you are a pawn up and you are winning so so many options then you have okay let's go with the isa idea gm isa f4 is okay gf4 what about this gf4 takes takes and now queen b2 with the idea long castle if I, I i was playing i i i i will simply take it and go go for a long castle even i can go for a castle and then moving king to this side open up this file for attack okay let's see what your opponent has did no not a recommended move i mean very weak move to me it's a weak move so now you can take this i think taking is good or even even taking first this is possible and then moving knight up is also possible both the moves are possible and moving knight directly is also possible what have you done knight g4 what an idea i mean what's what's the g sound go gg hello ji beta bhai मैडम मैं मैं क्लास में हूँ मैडम मैं मैं क्लास में हूँ इसमें थोड़ी देर में बात करते हैं ठीक है पंद्रह बीस मिनट में करते हैं ओके नाइट जी फोर व्हाट्स द आइडिया आई मीन ओके नाइट एफ टू एफ टू इज वीक है ना व्हाट अबाउट आफ्टर कासल लेट्स सी यस आफ्टर कासल I I don't see. I mean, you have still have to develop this. Why not moving this? You are delaying your development. I mean, it's not not a good idea to I mean delay the development. I mean, if this is a solid move, you should go for that. But if this is not, I mean, don't delay the development. Here, simply d6. Why not d6? Simple. I mean, it's a very simple move. Even you can sacrifice this pawn. because you are ahead in development white hasn't protected his king white cannot take this pawn now because this bishop is very dangerous g4 we have already seen so many lines for this so i think d6 was a simple idea to play here after this castle maybe maybe castle which is quite possible so you can go for bishop g4 to me yes bishop g4 is possible fg3 is also possible but bishop, i would like to play bishop g4 because this 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 is developing this pinning this line. and and if again again the opponent is trying to something uh something like uh, how can we get rid of this bishop h3 is the only possibility to get rid of this bishop. then coming back and queen d7 idea we have seen so many lines no f5 pawn is there yeah. so this is pin to so 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 many options we have seen i mean this type of variation king h2 is not 
playable. I mean, now this this knight is under threat. I mean, you are threatening this one. You are threatening this one. Both there are two threats. You know, so knight f6 is most probably move uh, white has to play. So now this is the threat, and uh, can he play this? I'm not sure. But if we did not play this, what move he can play? How can he protect this pawn? King h2 is possible. Yeah. King h2 is possible. Uh, maybe, maybe, maybe here d5. But still, you can break the center and because if you open up the center, the king will expo get exposed because all your pieces are now active. Rook can move here, rook can move here, even both the squares. You know, you're threatening something like this. So, ed5 is most probably the force move. Bishop d5, and now if c4, then you can go back something like this. Queen eight, e2 can be met, rook a d8. So, now this point is weak. This point is weak. This point is weak. So many weaknesses in the uh, white territory. Maybe bishop c is possible. Yes. Now you can move something like this as well. I'm not allowing your opponent to get some uh, pressure at this point. So, I mean, let, no. okay. Sorry? Rook A1? Put more pressure on, on the... On the Rook e, this one, huh? Yeah. Yes, this is possible. I mean, not you are threatening to this this pawn takes. But after rook a e1, what I can see is bishop take no, bishop. So you can you have to take this. And now this is hanging. I mean, at least if you take this, I can take this, and these pawn will be doubled. So this is one thing I can achieve. But now I can move something like this. To me, bishop f5 now threatening this one and this. There is a, I mean, if you take this, I will not, go, I'm not going to take this knight. I'm going, no, I have to take it. Well, because this knight can protect this. Knight e5 means knight e5. Knight e5, knight e5. So queen e5, and now bishop d3 is possible. So threatening to this rook. So queen f6 can be met, rook f6. Bishop has to protect to I mean Bishop to Duke to G1 and now I think black has a very good game. I mean knob you can take on C4, you have an extra pawn. You are going threatening this pawn. Bishop uh, both the bishop are of the same color, so there is no chance of a draw. White black is winning, I think. Okay, black, white can take this pawn too. But now rook d2 is very strong. Threatening this, threatening this, also threatening this. Moving this rook to seventh rank as well. So gf maybe gf4 rook f4. I mean this is now a part of end game. So look at it. So black is better. Obviously black is better. There is no doubt. If someone is winning in this game, that is black, not the white. If black white play a very good game, maximum we can get is the draw. Maximum. But I don't I don't think so he will get a draw. Very difficult for black. Oh, sorry, white. Because very weak pawn structure. All the pawns are isolated. And uh, he will soon he will be one or two pawns down. Soon. Okay, let's go back where we have stopped this. Okay, let's see. Castle, you played. Uh, I mean, this is what you played. No, here you push the pawn. Knight, knight, you played knight. Huh? Castle takes, takes. Okay. Okay, so here still d6 is. 
a better idea but i mean you should take care of this move as well i mean this b4 and b5 weakening this pawn you should take care of this as well black can counter play i mean something like this now because you have not, you are not moving this still you d6 is better thank you very much isa finally you did this okay good okay nice nice maneuvering of the knight i mean doubling the pawns weakening the pawns i don't understand this idea simply taking knight e3 you can get an advantage because this pawn has to move this side and this is a weak pawn this is a double pawn no you have you 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 are not interested in queen e8 is possible too yes i mean you're threatening something like this this checkmate i mean this is normally people think in this way huh? knight moves this and or i can take this with the rook and this this is huh? yeah. yes this is possible but this will never happen that this okay knight f okay i i don't understand the the moves order your opponent is playing i mean this is simply offering you a simple pawn i'm not sure why this is a simple pawn offer you have already threatened this here i think the best best move for white was to move something like i mean he has to after all he has to create some counter plane no? so center is something that he can create something so c3 is possible to push this one and if you keep continue with your plan something like this which you were thinking about that i can crush my opponent so okay he can simply move something like this now this is a pain and your plan has is is is, is on heart for the time being and uh, so what what will you do i don't understand g5 maybe sorry g5 Pawn g5, okay. but after pawn g5, knight g4 is possible. This one, knight g4. G4. Uh, bishop g4 maybe. No, bishop. This one. Bishop g4, yes. Bishop g4 push. Yes, queen b3 check. So first you have to say protect the king. So where where this majesty is, will go? Mm, king h8 maybe okay, h8, yeah. okay got it so now i can can i protect this one maybe 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 knight f5 maybe knight f5 yes and now you can get one pawn i think so bishop f5 ef5 can you take this i'm not sure it is good for black to take this pawn because, because this pawn is hanging too. Oh, okay. so this is hanging. hanging so this one this one. so it is it is not recommended i think to take the pawn better better is bishop b6 i think protecting this pawn but then white can move something maybe this one still you cannot take this is a trap there will be a fork so next move white is moving this one in any case protecting this this is a protected pass pawn and i think white has a comfortable game oh, yeah. i don't see any any more weaknesses in the black uh, sorry white territory so coming back to the normal game knight f5 and now you can take this taken take okay still queen h5 i'm dreaming about that huh? knight h4 is still possible 
yes now this has been defended so let's see but you can still take this book f5 there is a checkmate behind good you have taken oh opponent has pinned the knight wait just wait Okay, so a bit bishop after bishop F three. What have you played actually? Okay, nice move, nice move. I think this is the uh, this is the best move. What what if he takes this? This uh, one? Row F eight. Yeah, row F eight. Yes, that's very good move. Very well done, Isa. Yes, good. So now black has a some advantage. Was there any better idea? Let me check. Uh, I think rook f8 is quite possible. G5 was also possible, but I think the rook f8 is much, much better. This is also possible. The threatening directly to knight. Or push uh, g4. Yes. G5, g5. G5. I mean, this is possible. Yes. G5, and now what white will do to protect this knight? I don't see anything. I don't see. I don't see. Maybe queen f5 is possible. I mean, pinning this. But is it possible after this check? Oh, sorry, queen threat. Can he? I mean, he can. He can exchange like this. I think queen g6 check. You can take, take. But still, white black is winning. I think because this knight is trapped. So rook f, rook f2 is possible. Maybe rook f6 you can play. Why not rook f6? Threatening this knight and this knight is trapped. Yeah. So g5 was possible too. But rook f, f8 is okay too. This is also a nice move. No, no. Just wait. Uh, yes. So you played rook f8 and here white what are the options for white white has to save the queen obviously queen d5 check is i think the most candidate option yes so here <coughs> what to do rook f7 maybe no this is not a good option i i don't think so king h8 is not a not a better option there Rook f7, because now, but now what, what white will do against this? Maybe e3, bishop e3. But still black has better, I think. What about this and next? Oh, yeah. Okay, this is this is okay too. Yes. Uh, no, this is this is not a better option. I don't think so. After this, 
I mean, Black should have played this before, I think. But no, no, he can move something like this. Rook f6 is also possible. I mean, this is a threat actually. So maybe Rook f6 first. Yes, this is possible. So this check, there is a check, then you can move up. And now all the threads are in, in, intact. Let's see what happened. Yes, rook f6 played. Queen c8 check. King h7. Ah, it's not. A, I think now you got the chance to finish the game. Knight e3 maybe. Knight e3 is a better idea, I think. So... Okay, knight e3 takes, and uh, now check maybe bishop e3 check, king h1, yes, king g2. Oh, so I think how can you quickly finish this game? This is important. Tactics. Yes, good, good. Very nice move. I like this. King h3, the only move. Take the rope. Yes. King is safe. Queen is somewhere enjoying holidays in the Bali, Bali, I think, some far east. So there is no no way he can come back to defend his king. Even he, he don't have any news of that his king has been captured. He's enjoying. So taken, taken, finish, I think. Finish. You have a piece of, you have a positional edge. Very nice move. Bringing knight to the attack. Okay, queen e8. Still, still, this queen is aiming for some good moves. Good queen d1 check. Where do you go, man? King h3 is possible. Okay, h5. Okay, no. I'm threatening something like this. You are offering this one. Let me check. Okay, this check is made. Good, good, Isa. So, oh, your opponent finally surrendered, I think. So he said, okay, kill me, man. Why you are you teasing me? Huh? Just kill me in one shot. Oh, you did not kill him. Why? <laughs> just just uh, um, like overthinking, thinking too much. Yeah. Actually, but you know what? Where is the pit? <laughs> I mean, you're enjoying the game, huh? <laughs> yes, I mean, what I can believe, I mean, you're winning in a simple one move and you did not win. Okay, still you are not winning. I mean, now you have to reassess the game. How can you win? All other, all the moves can win, but this, yes, this can lead to a win too. I mean, in three or four moves, you can checkmate, but let's see. Uh, uh, okay, again, you got the chance. Yes, the same chance you get that you got again, and you, this time you did not miss. Very nice. Uh, Isa played well, except for some few opening uh, suggestions. I think the overall game is okay at your level. I mean, you plan the plan was okay. The f f instead of playing f four, uh, f uh, takes e pawn was a better idea. Immediately, quickly opening the uh, game, and I think that was a quick finish. To me, you, you could have got a quick, but uh, f f four plan was a better. Uh, what a good plan too. I mean, it was a save. Actually, white was doing nothing. 
to me white has no idea to how to play in such positions this is what you are enjoying this is what you are enjoying it, it has, um, yes it's not recommended some day at some day when you will you will meet some master or some good player then he will give you some fight and then resistance and when you're you at some point you will face resistance this is this is i i what i believe yeah. at some point because this is not a common line no uh, normally people don't prepare this oh. but uh, after 2000 maybe you will face start facing resistance oh. on it and uh, then you will will change minds change your mind definitely you will change your mind because then you will feel that this 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 variation has not much possibilities for black mm -hmm. so i have to change something up but at this level i mean at 1600 1500 okay enjoy maybe 1700 1800 you are winning okay no issue in the tournament you can play this too but you have got some ideas from from black side and white side so you now you can be, play better uh, game i think so okay so uh, okay it's i stand to end the class okay good. and uh, hopefully you are doing some tactics hopefully yeah yeah i i doing uh, uh, what, uh 200 puzzle course uh to this 200 puzzle. 200 puzzles, mashallah. Very good. That's good. good. Yes. Yeah, yeah, 200. Yes, very nice pace. I have I have asked minimum 50 to 60. So you did 200 puzzles. Good, good. I, yeah. I'm I'm I'm, uh, uh, I'm 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 happy to see that you're 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 struggling hard, and this is my guarantee. You keep struggling hard at some level. At some point, you you see now what I'm suggesting you is something that 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 I'm forcing you to change your style a little bit, okay. because the, where I see the weaknesses, I'm recommending you. After sometimes I will pushing you, okay? okay. Don't play this. Don't play this. Play Bec and it, I mean this the, the, and this is true too. I mean when you change your style. I mean, for the, for for some time, for some time, I mean, you uh, you are very comfortable in your positions, no? and you are winning. But when I see, okay, this is not a good idea. I'll try to play like this, and you start losing. Oh, yeah, this position I start because you are not comfortable with it. But after after sometimes after analysis, you will get used to that those positions and those solid positions, and you will start winning in the, those positions. You might face this type of problem too. Because some of my, my students face this problem. When I ask him, you uh, either they do not quit their favorite positions, like you are playing in with, either they do not quit it. Even my son, my younger son, 10 years old, I ask him, why, why you play this? This is not a good idea to play. He said, Baba, I always win this game. Why you are asking me? Look, today I played this again and I won. So I said, OK, you are right. After some time, you start realizing, okay, I was, I, it, 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 I mean, playing, Baba was right. So, it's good to see you that you are, you are, you, you have started playing tactics. Keep doing tactics. We, we, we will, we will analyzing this. If you okay. do tactics at your part, I mean, I think after some time, after some time, we should start end game, end games. Okay. So, do, do the tactics yourself. Okay. Maybe at some less, in, at at some in some lessons i i can go with you for with tactics just to check how 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 good you are now at the tactics and how much work you need but then we, we can start end game okay. end game is also very important important part so you do tactics uh, uh, at home and uh, uh, keep uh, uh, tomorrow and what end game and uh, uh, tomorrow what team scores uh, for uh, or still for or changing to Another F, something else. Sorry, uh, can you uh, uh, teams say uh, again? Uh, uh, tomorrow, teams, tactic teams, uh, puzzle. Uh, 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 I do it for uh, uh, just. Uh, yes, today. keep doing. I mean, okay. I I have given you four teams. Okay, four pin. 
for discover me. attack and discover check keep discover. doing uh, 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 i mean keep keep doing it okay. i mean 200 puzzles are not, not enough even 2000 are not enough okay. believe me so i will check your strength no don't worry if you if you are confident enough in the next session we can check okay. for 15 30 minutes we can do it or we, we quickly analyze the game and we can do, do some puzzle on these teams only so i will quickly check i mean how are you good at i mean i i, I can uh, guess fairly okay. so if you are good at okay we will keep i mean keep increasing the threat uh, strength of that so we will check it no no issue but this is something that you keep doing it to keep doing it i mean uh, it's, it's important i mean it's 200 or nothing i mean 2000 or nothing you you may go for 20000 i mean the more ideas you get the more the better i mean uh, you will be at board so if you are good at this then we will add two three more things in it so covering all the things this is something this is an uh, that you should do on uh, ongoing i mean keep doing it there is no stop in it even if you are a 2400 player you keep doing it okay coach you can increase the strength level of, of the tactics i mean you can choose some books or some some tactics that that are that are uh, that are of good 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 strength but keep doing it we we, uh, we will do it i mean at some point we will do it at uh, in the class as well okay. so i can see okay how how good you are seeing okay. at the at the tactics from very basic to some intermediate and advanced level we can okay. check okay. don't worry but keep doing it keep doing it i mean doing it one day two days is not not uh, i mean keep doing it even if you are taking classes with me or not keep doing it okay. this is a necessary part of your chess so don't leave it okay so minimum 50 to 60 if you don't have enough time you know, 50 60 is enough okay. but if you have more time you keep doing it okay and play at least one or two rapid games on daily basis two is okay i one with white one with black is okay more than sufficient two games tactics and some watching of the uh, on 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 ongoing games i mean some openings um, videos or something like that that you're getting some ideas good idea like you're getting with me or something like so okay. keep doing it i mean at this stage i am not recommending you to go for a proper opening repertoire i mean i i think you you should learn some basic principles right now okay so maybe up to 2000 2200 we, we can start uh, some proper repertoire opening repertoire because yeah. right now that you're playing viana or something like this f5 so when you change mine then we will see yeah, yeah. I, I also after this tournament i want to change my repertoire to to something for this more d4 huh? yeah yeah okay yeah, yeah, tomorrow i think i think i i will i will see some uh, some of your games which opponent has played d4 okay okay push. okay push. okay I, I will try to find some game okay push. if you if you see some games and you 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 want me to analyze that game just send me the link of that game oh okay good Sure, okay so 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 i i i should analyze that game okay, okay thank you coach. okay okay see you uh isa okay coach. thank you coach, for okay good night good, good night, night. Okay. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night.